I had to go all in on just one coin. Take all my money and stuff it into one coin. Which coin would it be? It's this one right here. <laughs> Welcome back to Crypto Games. Is it sounding interesting? Drop that like. You don't want to miss it. I don't care. And I'm going to bring it to you. Like again, because you know, if you watch my channel, you know the coin I'm talking about. <laughs> Which one am I talking about? I'm talking about a coin that goes by the name of Decentralized Social. I, If I had to take all my money, if I had to sell stuff out of my house, my chair, my shoes, because <laughs> I need money, my TV, I just to sell it, put it in DSO, I would do so. That kind of, and DSO, I'd do so. <laughs> this ain't financial advice, please do your money. I was going to say, please do your money. Please do your further research before you invest your money. Uh, and, and I've got to keep it real. With everything that's going on in the world right now, we have one of the biggest social networks. And by the way, for people that knew, DSO is all about decentralized social networks, decentralized social media, being able to do stuff without being restricted, without being censored, all of that. This is where it's going to happen. This is where it's going to spark and shine. I've seen other tokens that are trying to do what DSO is doing. And you'll probably come across a few of them. I think I've, seen, I've seen another one called Tacky. But <clears throat> DSO stands tall for me because the protocol is one of the first to do it. And it has an option to bring anything that you have. For example, if you create a social coin, which, by the way, that might be another big thing in the future. I'll just quickly touch on I've got a social coin, my channel. You know, if you like the channel, buy the token. And maybe in the future, you earn some crazy gains. Because if my channel does success, it is successful. So does you. So does you. So are you. You make money through my success. Uh, but what I'm saying is that's the future. And you can take your social coin across all of their different apps on the as far as I'm aware, right? So you you know you just build that huge social uh, uh, entity behind you and your brand or anything. But why would I go all in on this? All in on this is because of what's going on in the world today. You've got. Let me just get rid of that. <laughs> just say I'm happy, even I'm not happy to accept that. Uh, you've got people like. Well, it says here, four TikTok creators weigh in on what a ban would mean for them. People make a living on this, and people spend a lot of their time on TikTok. Again, I just, I'm just trying to put it out there. If, because, you know, we've seen some countries ban this, right? Because, you know, people don't, they don't like it. They don't, they don't like what's going on. Apparently, it's a privacy issue and things like that. But the fact now that it's starting to hit other people, other users that are using this, Maybe at some point they're going to look for another version of a TikTok. I don't know, starting again, having to start again, just that thought alone. Because if these guys have got 100,000 subscribers or whatever they got, and they got to start again, right from zero. And this is, again, this is why it comes back to DSO. Because your social following follows you across all platforms. It connects to your wallet. Your wallet remains the same, but your social presence, it doesn't matter which app you decide to go on. If you go on an app, because you know, let's come down, they've got loads of different apps. If you decide to you know, start on an app like TikTok, because they got like a TikTok version or something. Look at it. I love this. I'm not going to talk about, I did another video, you check the video, uh, the whole website and all sorts. But I'm just trying to find that part where it talks about the apps. Here we go. Because they got a bunch of different apps that do different things, you know, like a decentralized Twitter, a decentralized TikTok. And I know, I know they got that. Let me just find it. I'm going to find my TikTok. I'm going to find it. Here we go. Uh, story. Is this actually available right now? Can people start using this right now? Like your Snapchats, like your TikToks. Because then if you had this and you decide, you know what, I've got my TikTok now, got 100K subscribers, let me start something like an Instagram, you know, just use Pearl. Now your followers just follow you onto your Pearl app. And then it follows you onto your Telegram app, follows you onto your whatever it is, your Twitter, you know, because Diamond's like a decentralized. This is powerful. And this is why I'll go all in because this is going to shape up the, the entire decentralized or just the entire social media uh, industry. And we, they made a statement here, right? A valid statement. And I don't want to talk too much on it. If you can see the screen, just look at it. Like, I got a, the, the Restrict Act is a direct threat to the freedom speech. I don't want to talk on that because I don't want to get censored for any reason, but, uh, and then they talk about this bill here that the US government to monitor and ban virtually any software or any hardware with over 1 million users slash customers in the US. So if, if there's a platform that's doing really well, uh, something like a TikTok or something starting out that has a million users or more, uh, they could do whatever they want with it. They have the right to do whatever they want with it in that, you know, in the US because of this bill. 
So, you know, when you have a decentralized social media platform now, they can't do nothing because no one's in control kind of thing. You can't stop that. It's, it's a decentralized uh, platform that's going to, you know, run enough decentralized nodes and everything else to make sure people have that freedom to do what they want to do. This is the story app. You know, if you want to come and have fun with this, you can check it out. Uh, but it's just like your TikToks. Maybe these guys should be looking at story. Maybe people should start adopting this now. So then, you know, you build your fan base all over again, fine. But once you've got that, it's strong. You're now in a decentralized world. You're earning money for, free, you know, for doing the stuff that you do. Because on TikTok, okay, in TikTok, maybe you have to get a certain amount of views to start earning. But with this, you can make one view. If they like it, they can tip you. <laughs> it's just, just that simple. So you can start earning, monetizing straight away, uh, straight away with that. And again, if you, again, if you can link your social coin to this, I'm going to have to look into, stop uh, stop renting, start owning your, your brand, content for followers. Story has uh, been described as a decentralized version of TikTok, the new way for creators to take ownership and monetize their content. If you can bring your social coin, if you know, if Story even accepts a, a social coin, over to this, it's powerful. It's so damn powerful. And it wouldn't surprise me in the future if it does, if it's not already doing it. Because that's the future, guys. I really think the future is this whole social, decentralized social media presence and having like a social coin. You, you can just be a normal person, just chilling, you know, a beautiful looking female, just, you know, and you're looking nice. <laughs> and just, just because you're putting photos and stuff, but you got a coin. I have buy your coin. I'll buy your coin. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I'm going to buy it. And every time you do that something, because, you know, because I'll be looking at Instagram right now. Is it Instagram or YouTube? Where some girl, she's so damn flexible. And the whole leg just be going like that, like it's a clock. And I thought to myself, I can't even do one o'clock. You know, I put my leg like this and then it's just there. I can't go like this. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's going to drop that like, if you know what I mean. Uh, so, you know, people might come over here and start having fun with this. About NFT. I'll check that in a second. Um... <clears throat> this is where I'll go all in. Now, what would all in be for you? Because everybody has a different amount to what they would class as all in. Hold on, I've got other things here just uh, talking about TikTok. Uh, a TikTok ban would be a godsend for YouTube and Instagram. Well, of course it would. Because all those users that can't use it now would have to go somewhere else. So they come onto there. But I tell you what, it'd be a godsend for decentralized social media, DSO, and all the other de decentralized apps. It would absolutely change the game. If all these TikTokers come onto story, I don't know, maybe you're a TikToker right now and you're watching me. Now, that's what I'm saying. This could be a godsend. This could absolutely change your life and put you back on the roadmap for TikTok and you get all your fans, oh, just come come check me on story. Yeah, I'm about to get banned or it's about to close down soon. But before it closes down, just come into story. I'm, you know, it's just like TikTok, come over to story and just continue watching me. You know what I mean? I'm just saying like, that's what people do. And what else is this? Uh... Oh, uh, will TikTok be banned in the United States? I don't know, time will tell. Uh, and that was that. So what is all in for you? So like I said, I would sell as much as I can, everything I can, try and accumulate a huge amount of money. Uh, I don't know how much I'd get selling my stuff. You know, my sofa's kind of half broke. <laughs> I could see dents in the parts where I've been sitting for too long. Uh, the foam, you know, the foam just... So I'll probably get like 300 quid on that. <laughs> I wish I've got some clothes that I don't wear. Some, uh, I'm looking around and see what I can sell some picture frames that I don't need <laughs> uh, no uh, but really I would I would save all my money if I had to pull it all into one instead of loads of different coins let's say five grand let's say I managed to accumulate about five thousand pounds and pull it all into one coin Disa would be it five thousand pounds today nope that's 50 <laughs> would give me 550 coins and I would sit back and wait I think as social as people as people as time goes on and people start to realize how pissed off they're gonna be because you know all this st stuff that's going on the banning and the control is taking over their lives and ruining their you know their, their essentially their businesses and stuff they're gonna start looking for decentralized versions and once they realize it's available they're gonna start using them right and because of that this is gonna go high in price i believe it's gonna go higher than what it did before which the price is or oh, before it went up to like 128, 139 pounds, 143 pounds. I got it highlighted right here. 143 pounds. 
I think it's going to go higher. I think we're going to see a £1,000 price for a decentralized social. And when people start to come on and hear the names, because, you know, big YouTubers, you know, they'd be saying DSO, DSO, decentralized social media, decentralized, decentralized social media, DSO, DSO, DSO. People are going to come on to like, I don't know, because I still think coin market cap is more popular right now. They'll come over here and just you know, search DSO. What is this DSO? Why do I, I keep hearing DSO? What is DSO? They search it, bomb, decentralized social pops up it's the only coin that's popping up when you search DSO. and at some point in categories because you know you can click on currencies and click categories you're going to see a section that says decentralized social media DSO. and i can guarantee you that this one right here is going to be the star of the show I'm telling you, and that's why I'm putting it to you. This is not financial advice. I'm just telling you what's going to happen in the future, just like I called artificial intelligence before it blew up, right? So, you know, DSO, five grand, if I had if I put my whole everything in, because, you know, I'm trying to think um, if I was back then, because now if I put everything in, you put in millions. <laughs> just going to keep it real. But back then, if I put it all in, you know, five, trying to keep it real for average people as well. Um, so 550 coins. Should this go to where I believe it can go? A thousand pounds for one coin. Let's do this. Let's take the market cap. Oh, I didn't copy it. Hold on. So right now, the market cap is a 95 million market cap. Well, 95.7. <coughs> you got it that. Times it by... Hold on. I said it'll go to what? Oh, I have to do it by the price. I have to do it by the price. So a thousand pounds, and then I'll come to the market cap. <coughs> I'm saying it's going to hit a thousand pounds. You divide it by nine pounds and nine pence. I'm talking a 110x return on my investment right now if i times this by the market cap right here 95 million seven hundred thousand uh i'm talking a 10 billion 10.5 billion market cap just that bit there 10.5 billion and that's very doable i'm not asking for hundreds of billions i'm not asking for 50 billion i'm calling 10 billion I'm calling the 10 billion market cap where would that put that because you know if you think about uh, you know coins where we are right now What's got 10 billion? Right here, look, Cardano's at a 10 billion. I'd like to think that these coins here that we see in the top 10 would be much more, you know, 50, 60, 80 billion, and that's like the norm. Near 80 billion now, that's the norm because there's so much money in the space in the future, which means most of these younger projects are going to rise up and, you know, we will see like 10 billions, 20 billions. It'll be the norm because as more money comes in, these become normal in market cap sizes. So that's what I would do. What would that do to you then? Because if you've got 550 of them and you sell each coin at a thousand, well, forget you, me, uh, at a thousand pounds. And by the way, I've got more than that. I've got to keep it real. I, I'm holding more than that. And I, I just want to be a little bit transparent. I am. I would take my 550 coins and profit Oh, my £5,000 investment and turn it into 550 grand. And I'm going to sit back and wait. I don't know how long it's going to take to get there. I might be wrong. <laughs> this might just go to zero. I don't know. Like I say, it's not financial advice, but I'm just going to sit back and wait and see what happens. Uh, and obviously, if something crazy does happen during that time and I feel like I need to pull the money, then I'll, uh, then I'll pull my money. But until then, I'm, I'm, I'm good for this. I'm ready to go on this because this is giving me all reasons to all reasons to believe that this is how things are going to be in the future so i'm going to leave it here if this was helpful to you please drop that like give me a subscribe thank you for watching i appreciate you all become a patreon so you do not miss this stuff seven tiers take your pick i've, I've highlighted this one because that's my most popular tier uh you know you can see when i'm buying when i'm selling when i'm staking all of that stuff right in here and if you can afford it i got a ceo tier it unlocks my super alerts so basically my vip telegram group over there i talk to them way before i buy way before i sell i'm discussing things with them they're getting in early before i even buy them i'm just gonna keep it real they're always buying things before i buy them and then obviously when, <clears throat> when i have bought it i do the buy alert and then people can you know and the patrons can buy it so if you want that quick edge on the market come over there check it out and there's big money over there that know how to make money sharing great projects all the time I'm going to leave it here. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Cheers.